Before we continue with this breaking news, if you don't want to miss any updates about the Red Devils, don't waste time, like, subscribe to the channel, and activate the notification bell, let's continue. Manchester United plans to invest 64 million euros in Rafael Varane's replacement. After announcing the departure of Rafael Varane, who will leave the club in the summer, Manchester United has begun the hunt for a new central defender. Englishman Jared Branthwaite now appears to be the main target for the Red Devils. A few days ago, Manchester United confirmed that Frenchman Raphael Varane would leave the club at the end of the season. The 31-year-old will bid farewell to Old Trafford after nearly a hundred matches, not managing to replicate the performance he showed at Real Madrid. Naturally, Old Trafford will need to sign a replacement. In this regard, one name stands out, Jared Branthwaite. The 21-year-old Englishman had a challenging season with Everton but showed a sufficiently attractive level to catch the eye of major clubs. So far, Everton has been reluctant to sell him, but due to their weakened financial situation, they have begun to consider selling some players to generate revenue. Some players will be sold to protect the club's long-term stability, admitted Kevin Thelwell, Everton's director of football, recently. The world of football is always full of rumours and speculation, especially regarding high-level transfers. According to the Daily Mail, Manchester United may be willing to spend a significant amount to strengthen their defence. Although an exact figure hasn't been specified, it is estimated that United could offer up to £55 million, around €64 million, Euros, for a player they consider key to their future plans. Such financial moves are not uncommon in the Premier League, where big clubs spare no expense to secure the talent needed to compete at the highest level. Besides Manchester United's interest in a Liverpool player, other names are being considered as potential defensive reinforcements. Among them are Jean-Claire Todibo from Nice and Mark Gohi from Crystal Palace. Both have shown solid performances in their respective teams and are seen as viable options to strengthen United's backline. Todibo has stood out for his anticipation skills and aerial solidity, making him a highly sought-after defender in Europe. On the other hand, Gohi has impressed with his consistency and leadership in Crystal Palace's defence, attracting the attention of several major clubs. The possible arrival of new defenders at Manchester United reflects the team's ongoing quest to improve their squad. Defence has been an area of concern for the Red Devils in recent seasons, with consistency issues and injuries affecting their performance. Bringing in a top-level defender would not only provide a short-term solution but also contribute to the team's long-term stability. Strategic signings are essential for any club aspiring to compete at a high level, both nationally and internationally, and United is no exception. The financial impact of such signings is also significant. Spending large sums on players not only affects the club's balance but also has marketing and sponsorship implications. New signings can revitalize fan interest and attract new sponsors, generating additional revenue. For clubs like Manchester United, which have a global fan base, transfer decisions are both a sporting and commercial matter. Investing in top-tier talent can be seen as a strategy to keep the club at the peak of popularity and performance. In summary, Speculation about Manchester United's possible moves in the transfer market highlights the dynamic and competitive nature of modern football. With astronomical figures at stake and constant pressure to improve, Premier League clubs are willing to make significant investments to ensure their success. Whether United ups to sign a Liverpool player or explores other alternatives like Todibo and Gohi, it is clear that the team is determined to strengthen their defence and return to being a dominant force in English and European football. Manchester United fan, what did you think of this? Did you expect this or not? Leave your comments, I would love to know what you think. And stay tuned to the Man United News channel, because I am always posting the latest news about Manchester United. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any updates. Thank you for your attention, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.